tight security measures around our, around our examinations. What can happen usually may be, can be in the, in the examination centers, external assistance or something like that, but every, whichever way, every form of malpractice is as bad as the other. So any form of malpractice can get you, can, can, you, you are culpable in case you get involved in any form of malpractice. And the fine is, can be five years imprisonment or, uh, or, 20, or 20 million shillings or both. So we want to uh, ask the heads of centers, please don't get involved in abetting or supporting examination malpractice. To the learners, just be steady, uh, pray to God, be ready, be determined, just get yourselves prepared. If you've been reading all this time, I can assure you, you, you are going to be able to pass successfully. Your name has been very consistent and warning us not to stop students from doing exams. And we have also obeyed, but I would wish to request your name to also be cooperative and not give results to students whose names we have given that they didn't complete fees. Much as it is a part of Africa because of corruption, so we need to go down and we teach people from Nasale that if we corrupt, then we will be corrupted, even our younger generation, even the other generation that will come, will not have a blessing from the law, the Lord.